Trying to end around and no room to run. Swarming to the ball. Tennessee Tech loses four on first down, so a second and 14. Delayed handoff. Jordan Potts, the quarterback for Tennessee Tech, hands it off. Best run of this opening drive, but well short of the first down. Spencer Ashby gets it away cleanly. Evans makes two men miss. Here's Anthony Evans shutting off the speed. Excellent starting field position. And, you know, not even a ton of great blocking there, but some good reads. And then he sees, you see the speed kicking it to the outside, setting up a great return. Well executed. Knocking right on the doorstep of the red zone. Play action. Carson Beck, clean pocket. Dials one to the end zone. It's caught. Touchdown, Georgia. To talk about ETM, but right now this is Carson Beck's game. The beautiful touch on the corner route in Georgia up early. Tennessee Tech offense hoping for a better return. It was three and out on the opening drive. Potts. See, that's Jordan Yates, the wide receiver that they lined up at quarterback. It's Potts in there now. Play action in trouble. Down he goes. Shot out of a cannon. Jay, shot happened to Cannon's right. Look at the right of your screen. They're pulling a lineman from the other side to block him, but he just beats him with speed. A safety who snuck in. Potts didn't see him. Third and 14. A pitch. Well defended again. Quick hitter. Darian Smith, plenty of speed. Didn't get the blocking, though. Came in Spalding. Back-to-back -back tackles for the linebacker. That headset communication, a new rule in college football this year. Let's see what they dialed up on a third and 11. Beck unloads over the middle. It's caught for a Georgia first down. Just a great athletic play. More tempo here. Beck rolling right, fires quickly. It's another Georgia first down. Beck dumps it off to Robinson. Inside the 10, trying to turn those legs forward, falls to the six. See it and then just let it go and process that information is special. Back surveys, tosses to the end zone, touchdown Georgia. Colby Young untouched. Well, the first touchdown was a deep ball. Then they just started just chip, chip, chipping away. Then the nice crossing route to Colby Young. Touchdown last week, touchdown today. Georgia in control. This is slightly better field position for Tennessee Tech to start the drive. It's been tough sledding against this Georgia defense. Interesting, Rocky. That Play action. Potts swarmed. Blown up in the backfield. Munden is the guy that leaked through number two and caused the quarterback to have to escape out. You see there, number two with a great job. Flushing Malman. Jalen Walker off the edge, Potts diving forward. This will be close to the first down. Takes a snap, hands it off. Trying to turn that corner, get a yard, and he did. Jay Parker. Third and six. Potts, pressure coming. Lost the football, just has to fall on it. He saw four red jerseys. Intimidating sight. I mean, just a little X done up front there. You got Raylan Wilson, the linebacker, and then I think that was Munden coming right in behind him, forcing the quarterback. He sees a little bit of a crease and hits it. Really well done. Play action. Beck gets it out of quickly again. To the backfield. Good work. Good work. Instead, they go to Dominique Lovett. Boy, nice he's pass. got a motor. Play action to Lawson Lucky. Knocked out of bounds, just chip shot for the sophomore. And he puts it right through to put the Bulldogs up 17-0. Take a shot. Yeah. And they keep it on the ground and up the middle. There's been nothing doing all afternoon long. <laughs> I mean, that's some effort. 
Here's Trevor Etienne. A flash. There he goes. Biggest play of the day for Georgia. 45. So excited. We're going to kick the guy out. And then from there, look, that's the thing. You break through the front line, and then he has the speed to kick it to the outside. Quick hitter. Here's Dylan Bell. For a route concept coming. Tennessee Tech sloughs off. Back rolls right. Surveys the end zone. Throws a dart. Dominique Lovett. Touchdown, That's Georgia. Right. Plays like this, it's just fun. And part of it here is Carson Beck. Look at the patience. He didn't just run out of there. He's patient, surveying, surveying. Then as soon as Lovett gets a sliver of open area, it just puts the ball away from the defender on the outside part of the body of Lovett and minute 10 seconds remaining in this first half Georgia's defense continues to swarm good oh. good paycheck attached to the yeah, root canal as well gotta take the good with the bad in life right first play from scrimmage in the second half and ETN picking up where he left yeah, off that's a gain of 13 for the transfer from Florida championship game he knew he was coming back unfinished business here at Georgia, pump and go, and he's got Arian Smith wide open. Hits him for a Georgia touchdown. Continuing to deliver, Rocky. Here's a way to get back on track. Just throw a ball to your guy who runs a 10-1 and a 100. Let him run underneath it for the touchdown. The dog's up 30. It's setting up that play. 50-yard touchdown is the longest play of the year for Georgia. Jordan Yates lost the football. And Dan Jackson's all over the place. And then you see a bunch of defenders, and then the ball just gets dropped out. And, and nobody punched it out. Yeah. Yates just lost it. That's not some four time player now as a veteran in this secondary. Good blocking. Two flags down there. Robinson is inside the five. This could be coming back. So a double hold here. And let's see. Yeah, middle of your screen there is what they call that 71 earnest green. And then you see actually, yeah, yeah Drew Bobo got a deep cleater. Play action. Beck. Floats one. Lawson lucky wide open. And he goes in to score. Another quick strike for Georgia. Lucky. Good job, a little play action, rolling to his right. And you gotta love the route combination. You get a post, and then Lawson come underneath with the corner route, wide open. Right back to Robinson. Breaking tackles into the end zone. Touchdown, Bulldogs. Came back, and there's gonna be times where there's gonna be unblocked guys. You gotta break tackle. There's one, there's two, there's three. All the way in the end zone, incredible balance. And you mentioned it, Jay, the strength from to take pictures in your section. <laughs> they, they got a long way to go if they, they want to beat those guys, though. <laughs> yeah. uh, the fandom is unrivaled, uh, you know, all across the SEC, but especially here in Georgia. And it's funny how. <laughs> Georgia gets into the backfield again with his first career sack. You can see why Tennessee Tech has elected not to pass much today because it's just hard for that offensive line to hold up against those big boys up front. Jordan Thomas, not just in the mix, but in the top of the mix. Back to Aiden Littles. He's taken down in the backfield. Lost two. Olsen, the lefty, to end the shutout. And he does. So Tennessee Tech leads with something. But Georgia, a 45-point win. And the Dogs have still not allowed a touchdown through two games. Just a field goal allowed to Clemson and a field goal allowed to Tennessee Tech. Yeah, that's impressive. I Don't forget to subscribe.